have been a faculty here in IIIT since 2008. I head computer systems group here. So one interesting project we have been working uh, in the area of distributed systems is how we can process a large collection of video streams coming from a bunch of CCTV cameras. So for example, at a traffic intersection, uh, we saw a suspect car and we want to trace the path of the car. And in order to trace the path of the car, we can take a photo of the car and then query the system to find the path taken by the car. In order to do this, uh, so we have to use many interesting ideas from uh, distributed systems, database systems, and uh, uh, cutting edge techniques from uh, deep neural networks for uh, car re-identification. So in the area of image processing, we have built a domain specific language to express image processing pipelines. And these image processing pipelines are useful for expressing various tasks typically found in the area of computational photography. Once uh, the, an image processing task or an image processing pipeline is expressed as a DSL program, we have our compiler which takes this program and synthesizes a circuit which can be uh, deployed on an FPGA. In the area of architectures for uh, machine learning and uh, specifically deep neural networks, we have been working on how to deploy inference models both on the data center side and on the edge. On the data center side, we have built overlay architectures using which many cutting edge uh, deep neural networks can be deployed on these uh, on our overlays. And on the edge side, we have been working on how to design uh, neural networks, you know, specifically deep neural networks with low memory footprint and uh, which require less compute power at the same time so that they can be used on uh, low cost embedded systems such as microcontrollers. My research activities within the CSG Research Center fall under two broad themes cyber physical systems and intelligent transportation. Within the cyber physical systems theme, I'm mainly interested in design and analysis problems for CPS. Specifically, my team works on developing analysis and design automation techniques for execution of applications in multi or many core cyber physical systems, considering critical performance constraints such as end-to-end -end deadline, data freshness, thermal budget, mix criticality, security, reliability, etc. One prominent example of a CPS that we are interested in is automotives. We explore analysis and design solutions taking the performance constraints into consideration for in-vehicle platforms consisting of multiple processing units and state-of-the-art communication protocols like time-sensitive networks, controller area networks, etc. The second broad theme that my team is working on is design and analysis of edge infrastructure for intelligent transportation systems. Within this theme, one thread delves into the design of edge infrastructure for cost efficient and timely delivery of data and services to connected vehicles. The data could consist of high definition maps, software function updates, etc. And the services could include computation offloading to edge infrastructure. The design of edge infrastructure involves deriving resource requirements like computation capacity, storage capacity, and communication bandwidth to vehicles. Another thread looks at efficient edge node implementation of machine learning or deep learning algorithms on edge nodes for ITS applications such as traffic flow monitoring. I have a background in compilers and parallel hardware and algorithms. So with the possible end of Moore's law and the limitation of multi-core and SMT hardware, the field of computer architecture is in flux. Over the past three to four years, FPGAs and ASIC based domain specific hardware like the Google Tensor Processing Unit is emerging to be a very attractive alternative for application acceleration. Well, in my thesis, I'm working on designing FPGA based accelerators for deep learning and image processing systems. My focus is primarily on overlay based architecture designs which lie at the intersection of fixed function hardware and general purpose processors. I'm very excited to be part of this niche and emerging research area. Well, I hope to contribute something substantial through my research.